Hi, it's Alex over here at Mobile Homes Factory Direct. I'm going over a legacy home. It's a four bed, two bath, 32 feet by 52 feet. And uh, we're gonna walk around the front of the home and then we'll go on the inside and uh, make sure you leave some comments if you have anything, anything to say. If you have any questions, also you can comment or you can give me a call, 210-383-3133. So this was, this is also another great one if you want more of a a, a square looking house versus you know if you stick with the single wide and you start to get to the three bedrooms and get really long. Uh, well, any one of the single wides are pretty long anyway, but uh, this one's nice size on on the front siding. You have the smart board, the wood smart board on the right and left side, and then on, in the middle you have more of a plank a plank looking almost like. A, almost like roof shingles looking on the front so it looks good and then you have a peak up on top with a little vent up there and look at this front door compared to a lot of the other front doors that I've seen and I've recorded this one looks pretty nice it has the the glass insert right there lets in a lot of natural sunlight all right so as we walk in Nice big living area, uh, a little bit bigger than most because it almost takes in just a little bit, maybe two or three feet of that hallway space right there. And it's closed off from the kitchen. So if, you, if you're looking for something that doesn't have an open floor plan like most homes, like most of the mobile homes that, that, that we have, this one's one because it has this, it has this big old wall right here. Um, separating the living area from the kitchen. Alrighty, nice big windows right there. So let's start over here in the bed in the bedrooms. We'll go to the kitchen and the master bath. So remember, this one has this is a four bedroom. So you walk in. This is a decent sized room. I'd say maybe a ten by twelve. I like this one because even it, it it's not super super upgraded, but it's not it's not a a uh, really really inexpensive one. Look up on the top; it has like a crown molding, and then around the doors, it has a trim pieces as well. And these doors look pretty nice too. Here's another one. In our homes, uh, oh, another thing to mention, this one has the AC vents up on top, up on top, which is an awesome upgrade. So you're not restricted to put something over the AC vents when they're on the floor. A lot of our homes, you'll notice there's construction material or, or unfinished pieces right here. It just it makes it easy for us to to um, disconnect them and. And deliver them to you easier if if you'd like to get one from our lot right here or if it's quicker to get one from the lot if you're in a, a time restraint we can get you one here from the lot so this one has uh, you don't see this too much two shelves in here that's pretty nice two shelves in the uh, in the closet here so this is the third bedroom that we're going through and these windows are not, this particular one does not have the, the vinyl windows. These are aluminum windows. Awesome. So this one's a, the guest bath, almost like the, also for uh, the people that live in the first three bedrooms. But it has two sinks, cabinets in the bottom, cabinets in the center. You have a medicine cabinet right here in the middle. That's pretty awesome. Look at that. Two, uh, two glass, glass pieces, the mirror glass pieces and the, uh, and the fixtures up top. You got a vent up at the top, four piece shower, plenty of space in here. That's awesome. 
This is the first one that I've seen where the guest bathroom has a, the two sinks in it. All right, so now for the kitchen. Look at all this cabinet space. You had a huge up and down, I mean, um, tall cabinet right here. Could fit a trash can in there if you'd like, if you don't want to keep it out. The cabinets have also that piece up on top, almost like a crown molding. So much cabinet space in here. Microwave also included dishwasher, electric range. Remember all of our all of our homes come with the appliances included. More cabinet space right here in the bottom. And then you have a you have a um dining dining area right here in the center. I mean on the right side. Alright, so that, let's go into the final room, the, the bedroom, the master bedroom. Huge space, huge window to let in sunlight. Crown molding up on top. AC vent on top. Smoke detector. Light. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six outlets on the bottom. Let's walk into this uh, closet right here. And look at that. You have a bunch of space right here. You got a shelf on the right side. You got a two shelves, two level shelves right here, wire shelves. And then you have some more space up here. That's probably for the water heater, but you can, you know, you can put some stuff up on top, some storage stuff. And then on here, and then in here is a master, the master uh, bath. Nice big cabinet right there, all the way from the bottom to the top. Two mirrors and two light fixtures, medicine cabinet in the center, a bunch of cabinet space in the bottom, and the toilet is by itself in this little room. Then you have the shower, which is next. And then the tub. Small. Small window right there. And then you walk into the utility room. Washer and dryer, you have your wire shelving right there. And then the door, you have a uh, little window. So you can look out back. Hey, thank you for watching this video today. Uh, remember this is a, a four bed, two bath uh, legacy home. And and what stands out on this home is the, fact, is the, is the space, the four beds. The, the fact that it's a double wide and has a bunch of cabinet space in the kitchen, big old, a big old master bedroom. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to, to call me, 210-383-3133. Send me an email at alex.mhdirect at gmail.com, or you can leave a comment uh, at the bottom. Don't, don't forget to hit subscribe if you want to see some more, some more uh, homes. Now, 210-383-3133. Hope to hear from you soon. Have a beautiful day. Thank you for watching.